Round Rock Express starting pitcher Ryan Fearbin survived Tommy John surgery in 2009, but will be the first to tell you it's a painful one-year recovery process. Well, it's a grueling procedure, grueling rehab. You know, um, I don't wish it on anybody, but it, it has one of the best success rates out there. I think 80, 85 percent success rate. They take the tendon out of your wrist. They they put a clamp and hold it here, they snip it here, snip it here, and they pull it out, and then they insert it into your elbow down here. Fearbin regained his command before his velocity, which delayed his return, but last year while playing in the Independent Atlantic League, Fearbin got his speed up above 90 miles per hour, which got him noticed. The work I put in, I keep going back to the work, but that's what it is. All the shoulder programs and stuff, it's paying off for this year, and the is still there. Left-handed pitcher Ryan Fearburn's 107 innings pitch is tops on the Round Rock Express. He also has 74 strikeouts, which also leads the team, and a 3.70 earned run average, which is near the top amongst the starters. All good signs for a pitcher overcoming Tommy John surgery. I attribute a lot of my success this year to our pitching coach, Brad Holman. We've always had this bond to where He's like a father type figure to not only myself, but other guys, but what he says you listen to. Ryan has four pitches, including a two seam and four seam fastball. His go to pitch is the changeup, plus a great curveball and slider. I've always been a pretty much a location guy, being a lefty that throws high 80s, low 90s. Um, Changeup's always been there, but working with Brad, getting my breaking balls, both curveball and slider, being able to throw them for strikes. You want to give a shout out to the scouts, the Texas Rangers organization? I do, actually, I do. Uh, Roger Coriel was an area scout in uh, Cleveland, Ohio. He was checking out a kid. He ended up seeing me in my high school gym and I stepped on a mound for him and he videotaped me and a couple days later I get a call from Brad Holman saying that our scouting department had uh, questions about you and later that night I ended up signing with him. So what would it mean if Ryan Fearbin should get a late season call up to the big leagues? This is my lifelong dream is to stick in the major leagues. It would mean the world to me if I got the opportunity. Down on the farm in Round Rock, Jeff Power, Rangers Insider.